Hey everyone, it's Samantha from Scrapmasters Paradise and today I have a Coco Daisy kit unboxing for you guys. I subscribed to their Project Life style kit and also their scrapbook style kit. I just really loved their style. I really like the way everything was packaged. They have a little like pizza style box. So since this was my first month subscribing, they had actually run out of the Project Life um, kit for the month. So I just have a couple of pieces of it and then I have the full scrapbook kit to show you guys. So I'm just gonna unbox the whole thing. They've got some tissue paper on here. Well, here's a little card. It says, all of our exclusive Coco Daisy products are proudly made in the USA, then lovingly packaged for you in Michigan. So it's a really cute little card. It has a geo tag where they are located. For the August Project Life kit, I just got the cards. They were just out of the full kit, so I didn't get any of the embellishments or alphas that go along with this one. I'll go ahead and move that kit out of the way and show you guys these. Zoom in a bit. And I am really digging the lighting in here. I think the setup is gonna work really nicely. Let me know what you guys think. So let's go ahead and open these. So these are um, really nice thickness. Uh, they feel a little bit smooth not glossy they don't look glossy at all but they do have a bit of a i don't know a sheen to the feel of them i think they'll still be easy to write on with any kind of pen but i just really like that so you get two choice colors for that everything else i guess is a little bit different so we'll flip through all of these remember this moment oh i love that the best smiles an airmail postcard, so you get a different orientation on this one. Journaling, all oh, the gnomes. I think the gnomes are really cute. I know gnomes kind of creep some people out. From this moment, this moment, best day ever. Clouds, family, house equals home. Heart, home is where the heart is. Journaling space, hi. This one says, this moment documented. When was the last time you did something for the first time? Journaling space, there's a place you could put the date. Is this real life or is this just fantasy? <laughs> Cute. Journaling, ooh, I like that pattern a lot. Life captured. Ledger, a day in the life. Come with a lot of cards. You do you, that's cute. Another August title card. So this one you could do either orientation. Journaling. There's no place like gnome. So cute. I do like the gnome stuff. Life is the true adventure. That one's really pretty. I love the colorful title on that part. An oar, two oars, noted, pattern, just journaling space, postage stamps, some more journaling space, an amber sand with some map behind it. That one's really pretty. And some word bubbles and rolling with my gnomies. Very cute. So I think I'll get a lot of use out of these. I do like the quality. And for some of these, I really liked both sides of the card. So it's going to be hard for me to decide which side to use. I do uh, my Project Life not in the pocket protectors. So if you use the pocket protectors, you definitely could use both sides of a card. But since I actually stick them down to card stock, I won't be able to use both sides. So moving forward, I think with my kit subscription, if I really like a set of cards, I will just buy a duplicate set. I think this set was really cheap, just the set of cards. So I may end up doing that in the future. I, if I thought about it, I would have done it this time, but I didn't think about it. Moving on to these four by sixes. So I'll flip through these, a map, a postcard. I love this one, just a really pretty title card. And then you could do journaling on the back side. See, maybe I do want to order a second batch of these. They're really cute. Let's just stay home and chill. I bet they're already sold out now that I think about it. They do end up selling out of their stuff really quickly from what I've seen. A little calendar and then some triangles, and in the background, there's a map. Hopefully you can see that. Really, really pretty. So these are Coco Daisy exclusive things. I just really, really liked this whole kit. I was kind of disappointed I didn't get the whole kit, but those cards will definitely come in handy. So some of the kits out there, I really do feel like you don't 
get a whole lot for your money, but I felt like with this kit, it had a lot of stuff in it, and especially it had a lot of papers in it. So I'm really pleased with this kit. I think I'm gonna really like being subscribed to this one. For washi tape, they have a plaid, just a thicker washi tape. And then this is from Pink Paisley Outfitters in Ephemera, and you can pause that and look at those up close if you want to. with the letters that spell out August in the wood chips. Let's see, August. I'm trying to spell it out. August. So you could use that as a title card or on a layout. Very pretty. And then some twine. I think this is Jenny Brolin, Bolin twine. It's a really thick twine. Then some bean board alphas, and I've got some of these in pink, and I absolutely love them. I think these are wood veneer looking ones. Let's see what it says on the back. Wood plank design. These alpha beans do include a bunch of letters. I really like that it's so many letters. A lot of alphabet sets are so scrawny. They have like a couple of letters of each one. I always find I need a lot more letters than the packs have. But here is the stamp set for the month. I think it always comes with a stamp set. And then some Evilicious On Our Way Puffy Stickers version two. Very cute. And then some more alphabets. These are just mini alphas in brown pear. Also jelly bean soup, so they will match really nicely together. The two alphabet sets will match really nicely. So here's the paper. And Coco Daisy does some exclusive papers in here, just like they do the exclusive journaling cards. So some of these are um, Coco Daisy papers, and they're really nice and thick. It's a nice, thick, smooth cardstock. So this is called Around the World. That one's really pretty too. And then this one is from Pink Paisley. Let's see what. Oh, and it includes like a little border on the bottom too, which is nice. I love when pattern papers do that. When pattern paper companies do that. I love that one. Here's another pink paisley. See, I don't know where the name on these is. I don't think it has it on here. Pebbles. This is another Coco Daisy one called Here and There. It's got the cloud map. Very cute. Green chevron. This is a pink paisley. Pretty. And then a simple stories bloom and grow. Got the gnomes on it and flowers. And this is a basic gray clippings called Gazette. This one is Simple Stories Bloom and Grow Chin Up Buttercup. Then another pink paisley. All right, I don't like that one at all, but I really like this one. I like the gradient. This one would be great for sunset photos. And so this one includes three sheets of cardstock, and I don't know the names of these. They are basil cardstock, so they have a really nice texture on them. It looks like these two are just a regular textured cardstock, the green and the blue, and then the white has a wood grain texture. I don't know if the camera is going to pick up on that at all. Hopefully you guys can see that a tiny bit. I don't know if you're seeing it or not, but it's really pretty. So all in all, I think this was a great kit. And that is it for this video, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give me a thumbs up if you like haul videos, and be sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.